You're going to win. I mean, is that where the pressure is on you more than anything, isn't it? Because expectations are so high. A lot of pressure on. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I said to the team, if I win, I'll do a nude streak down Douglas Prom. So, <laughs> can we film it? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. We to digitise a bit out, maybe a, a little bit. No, you're gonna have to get a long lens on to capture that. <laughs> <laughs> I was at the back of the queue when God was handing them out. Too much but, information. <laughs> well, yeah, no. You're it, gonna streak it, down. Oh, I, I, I will, if, you win. if I win, I'll streak down, streak down the prom. Wow. I mean, it might end up in obviously a Manx jail, but uh, <laughs> I would do it. That's, that's the word. Uh, I, I don't know. Hey, listen. If I had a, if I had a crystal ball and look into it, I would tell you. <laughs> But this place, you know, it's got everything, you know, bikes can stop, you know, you slip off it somewhere or a bad pit stop, boom, bash, all of a sudden you're in the you're in the, the seat where you can actually win. But have I got the pace with my hand on my heart? Probably not. Uh, there's three or four guys out there, as, you know, not hungrier than me, but they're younger and, the they're, they're, you know, they're, they're, they're probably prepared to push the envelope a little bit further than I am at, at this stage in my career. But, uh, you know... I just want to ride my bike, cross the line, enjoy it. And after that, tell everybody how good I used to be. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to win now because we've got to have that streak, OK? I've got the exclusive on this one. We're, we're going to cover it. John, listen, have a great time. Have you been around the course much, by the way, since you've been back? I came the wrong way around the mountain last night when I got off wrong the ferry, Is that which was real scary, because uh, you think you know where you're going. I was going to say it's think, weird, isn't it? Only go one way. <laughs> so I saw a little bit of resurfacing up. Yeah. through Stella Maris and the hairpin. Looks epic, that. Um, it's going to add more speed, doesn't it? No, it probably won't. No? No, I don't think so. It might be a tenth or two, but, I mean, you can ride over bumps fast, you know. <laughs> it's just not as comfortable. You know, when you're, you're all smooth, but it's not, quite, it's not as physical to ride. But, I mean, nothing's changed from we're here in Ramsey to, to Ginger Hall. I mean, yeah. that's just still like a huge motocross circuit, but... So, which is nice, you know, it needs them different types of the track to give it that uh, personality it's got you know so but yeah I I don't like driving around you know you know I don't like driving car. I, I, I do and I respect the place but you just think you see obstacles you don't really want to see <laughs> when you're on the bike it's just obviously dot to dot to A to B to yeah. you know so it looks different when, you, when you're on the track so so have you got a bike with you at the minute to do any practicing at all no, you going to borrow no. some bike do you, do you want to borrow a bike I'm all right, thanks. Got a little moped I'm somewhere? Right, maybe yeah. you can I'm all right. I'll ground it van with radio on, I think. So I'll wait. have plenty of time to ground in 37 days, it is. So. Oh, the countdown. But do you bring your motorhome over in plenty of time to do your No, practicing? like I say, I'll be over early. We've got, you know, I'm going to run my own 600 team, so I've got a little bit of work to do with that. Uh, you know, I'm going to bring my own other truck across and, and ah. uh, set up set up with that. I've got some personal friends who chucked a couple of quid in the pot to, to run that, because Honda aren't going to run my 600, so... Uh, but I like to get across early. It's just getting to that little bit of bank way alive, you know. Just <laughs> breathe the air and get get, you know, the bit of you know the food and the people and just scrutineering and, and the rest is for just the build up and then you know it'll be it'll be all hands on deck in a way. Who could have thought it'd be three years without anything happening like you know? Well, that's hey, it's one that, of the curve balls. We all get yeah. you know it gets chucked at us, you know. Just thinking your wins would have been up goodness as well. <laughs> Tw 23 wins if, that, if I don't get them all. I never thought when I came here in 96 as a newcomer with my orange jacket on I'd be sat here at 50 mm. where are we Ramsey Park Park whatever <laughs> yeah. new, new old self posh isn't it <laughs> and with 23 wins you know I never, never thought yeah. I'd ever achieve anything like that you, so. do, you do count the electric don't you <laughs> electric bike race mm. I thought to do 122 on a 260 kilo battery oh, cool. from a standing start you know people go uh, you know it's not really a win well, you wouldn't want to be sat on the back of it, I tell you, because you know you're pushing the envelope there. It's all didn't, whole prototype didn't stuff. Of gravity, though, isn't it? Just everything well, about it, you know. I mean, when they first turned up, they did 102. Yeah. Did Mugen, and when they last went, they did 122, and it's under the radar because nobody's massively interested in it at the minute. They're not embracing it, but not what, in having one this year, are they? What they achieved, mm. you know, you've got a doff your hat to them boys, so, and I really, really enjoyed that working progress with them, and and you know. They, those guys are way ahead of what we are. Do you think you know? TT will ever be electric, like fully in in our lifetime? Or no, yours? No chance. Than me? No chance. No. I don't think so. Will be. Uh, and okay, finish with this. Do you think TT has got a future? I know that's that yeah. sort of question. But. Absolutely. Look at all here now. All the riders are all 
buzzing about it. I, I tell you, I got, I've been to shows. I've been to, I've done chat shows in winter. I've done dealer functions in Honda, and it's flat out. You know, oh, I can't wait. To, you know, I can't wait. I'm going for the first time. You know, I'm going to take my car. I've got my, I'm taking my son with me. You know, we're camping here. It's absolutely, <coughs> just a height of everybody's. You know, they don't talk about BSB or to me. <laughs> no. It's just flat out TT gossip all the time. So it's as strong as it's as, it's as strong as ever, all and right. uh, I'm sure it, it will be forever. Just checking cough day. Have you had COVID? <laughs> Probably, I've had worse, I've had worse diseases in COVID. You need to get it out of the way because the last thing you need is having it. Well, I've probably had it three times. I don't know. I never, I never, I know. I never checked myself. What are you going to check yourself for? I've got it. I haven't got it. Well, does it matter? I don't know. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm sounding a bit, you know. But you know, people have obviously had it and, and lost families and friends. So you know, I'll take yeah. a little bit of that back. You know, but it's, uh, I'd say, hopefully. We're all healthy. We're all in one piece. We all turn up, you know. Uh, you know, there's a bit, a little bit of racing to do before we all get here. So there's, there's Alton Park BSB in Donington, and, and you know, it's uh, every TT rider who does short circuit racing in the back of the mind is keep out of trouble. I was gonna say, don't you, get injured. Are you going to be careful yeah, so you don't have honestly, any? I, I, I've been doing the first two BSB rounds, and I'm like, <laughs> just leave me alone, lads. Just you know, I've got a bit, I've just got a bit on in a few weeks, you know. Yes, that's the last thing you need. Yeah, exactly. Thank you very much for talking to us. Cheers. <laughs>